And today is the 89th annual Hollywood Christmas Parade. We're excited to catch up with various guests and VIPs on the red carpet and hear about their Christmas joy. The Hollywood Christmas Parade has been going on for 89 years and is located on Hollywood Boulevard in California. I'm so excited to be here today. I know last year we weren't able to have it go on, but this year we're bringing it back better, more extravagant, and it's so exciting. I know Sienna's going to be on the carpet today. Ooh, I did not know that. Oh. I'm so excited to talk to him because I didn't get to see him last year. Well, you got to tell him what's on your list, Lynn. This Hollywood Christmas Parade is raising money for which organization? Marines Toys for Tots. This organization raises money to give kids in need Christmas presents during this holiday season. Wow, that's incredible. So tell us about what your organization does for kids. Obviously you get toys for kids. What's the scope of, of this project and how long has it been going on? Well, if I could start with the history a little bit, and, and this is very significant because our program started right here in Los Angeles in 1947 when a group of, of young Marine reservists uh, got together and they decided to collect uh, toys and books and then on Christmas morning in 1947 they put on their dress blues just like this and they uh, they went out into the community here in Los Angeles and passed out toys and books to less fortunate children just to bring some joy and happiness to them. Uh, the program d began to expand it uh, soon became nationwide um, and uh, in fact this past year uh, we were represented and had campaigns in all 50 states to include Guam, Puerto Rico, and the U.S. Virgin Islands. And despite the pandemic, we were still able to reach 7.4 million children. What made you take the step in wanting to take over this Toys for Tots? Well, you know, Marines, we're always looking for to, to make a difference. And when I was offered this opportunity, I thought it was a perfect way to continue to make a difference, except in this case, and make a difference in the life of children. And so that's, that's what I'm committed to doing. Thank you so much. Thank you, Thank you for much. all that you do. Thank and you. I hope you enjoy your night. Thank you. It's a, it's a wonderful evening. And thank you for helping us get the word out about what we do. And of course, we, we need the support of the, and the generosity of the American people. So please continue to help us. What is the best way to support Toys for Tots? Two of the best ways is when they see a toy collection box in a business or in a local community, drop a brand new unwrapped toy in there. Or they can just go to our website and make a monetary donation. And so that sounds easy enough. Thank you. And thank also, you very much. Thank you for the Marines for all that they do, right? Yes, sir. This is what it's about right here. Absolutely. Thank you for your service. Thank you, sir. How excited are you guys to be back here hosting the Hollywood Christmas parade again? It's wonderful because last year we had to stay home. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. The last year we did a the ten, uh, the best of ten, and we aired that. You know, but tonight it's We're live. Back. We're back, and it's live. The people are here. All the children up and down the route will be here. We got it's Santa. Beautiful weather. We got brand new performing acts. We've got new balloons. We have a new float with a two-ton potato on it. That I, that's I'm really excited to see that potato. Uh, yeah, I want to see. <laughs> yeah, cook me up uh, potatoes and a few bacon. French fries. Yeah. And, <laughs> it's wonderful. Can't wait what they're going to do with the potato afterwards. French fries, mashed potato. Baby, we're going to cook it. <laughs> well, awesome. Thank you so much, and I hope you guys enjoy the rest Thank of you. your Merry Christmas. We'll see you out there. It'll be hash browns all week. <laughs> Both of you guys, how does it feel being here on the carpet today, supporting Toys for Talk? Well, first of all, to be standing next to an icon like the Jerry O'Connell from the talk on Huge. CBS and the CW, you know, we kind of partners in crime, CBS, CW, so we had to come. Plus, we support Marines Toys for Tots because every kid should wake up with a toy for Christmas. It keeps you believing. And I do have a mask. I'm just not putting it on. So, uh, speaking about Toys for Tots and Christmas and everything and family, you know how kids, sometimes they wake up and they don't have presents or mm -hmm. they're not with their family. What does it feel being blessed with being able to celebrate with your family and being able to celebrate Christmas with presents and just... That's why we're here. That, that's what this is all about. That's why we're here. So that no kid out there feels alone. If we do what we're doing right now, then every kid will have someone 
by their side for Christmas and something under the tree for Christmas. That's what this is all about. We're blessed with great lives. Uh, we have great families ourselves. We put in a lot of work to keep that. But now we're going to do something for somebody else. It's about service. It's about community. And it's about all of us coming together for the holidays. However you believe, we want you to feel the love of that. Uh, and how are you guys going to celebrate the holidays? I'm going to Jerry's house. Oh, yeah. I'm going I'm to jump the fence. I'm going to yep. fight a dog. Because yep. I hear they got good food over at mm -hmm. Jerry O'Connell house. Yeah. Um, we're... Uh we're gonna probably. I'm, we're probably not gonna cook. We're probably gonna pre like buy pre-made food. Um, but uh, just uh, with my parents and everything, it'll be nice because they're older and we can see them this year. We couldn't see them last year, so just family. His wife is the beautiful Rebecca Romain. And in my mind, she is my closest and dearest friends. We are both Scorpios. I know she loves me. I know she does. We got two Scorpios in the house. Yes, yes. That's really the true reason why I want to be Jerry friend. Yeah. Uh-oh. Was I supposed to think that in my mind? <laughs> it's all okay. It's the holidays. Anything goes. But you know what's great? I'm going to tell you what's really, really good. Over at the top, we got a whole new crew. You know, we got Amanda Close. We got Akbar Bajabia Miller. We got Natalie Morales and Jerry O'Connor and myself. And, you know, we want to get out more in the community. We want people to see us. Most people see celebrities and they see us working or or even on a red carpet but this is a red carpet for a cause so it's great to be here and one day you might be doing a talk show of your own I know. and then we'll be switched Ooh. yes okay okay i'm gonna speak it into existence speaking into existence yes and wouldn't that would that be something you want to do yeah absolutely absolutely so she's doing it right now we're getting there. We're working. Yeah, that's right. All right, awesome. Thank you guys Thank so you. much. It's so, so nice much. having you guys here. Thank you. Supporting Toys for Tots. Thank you for everything. Thank you. Thank you. All right, so how does it feel to be back here on the carpet and on the parade again? Well, this is the 89th annual Hollywood Christmas Parade. And it's really amazing to have an opportunity to get people back out, enjoying the festivities, and reminding them that Christmas isn't about what you get. It's about what you give. And, you know, being sponsored by Toys for Tots, Hopefully we'll remind people that, you know, there are a lot of families out there that are still hurting right now. And a lot of kids might otherwise go without toys if it was not for Toys for Tots. And this parade has been something I think has, has demonstrated, you know, so many people that are watching right now. They'll remember Toys for Tots. Maybe over the next month they'll drop something in a bin when they go to the grocery store. You're helping to take care of another family. Not yeah. All right, let's give this a try. Could you hold your hand out like this? And what was your name one more time? Lynn. Lynn, awesome. Hold it just like that. I want you to think of any color. You you know in the deck of cards you have a red card, you have red cards and you have the black cards. Can you pick a red or black? Don't don't look in my mind. I let's see. <laughs> um Okay. You got one? Yeah. Okay, just say it out loud. Black. Black cards. Yeah. Do you want to get rid of the reds or do you want to keep the reds? Get rid of the reds. Get rid of them. Okay, perfect. This is already so tense. <laughs> I'm just waiting to see what's going to happen. So we have the black cards, right? Yeah, you know just, the black cards? Just black cards. Just black cards. We got the ace and we all the way through the king. Right, so ace, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, Jack, Queen, King. Um, would you decide if you want to keep the high cards or the low cards? Which one do you want to keep? Oh, I want to keep the high cards. High cards? Yeah. Okay, so that means we have the ten, yes. Jack, Queen, King, and the ace. Now, from that selection, okay, we have the black cards, high cards. Now we have spades and the clubs. Do you want to keep the spade or the club? Spades. Spades. So now we have the spades, ten, Jack, Queen, King, through ace. Okay, now uh, from those... Pick one of them. And, and tell you? Yeah. Let's do the jack. The jack. So the jack of spades. Did that feel like a free choice? It did feel like a free choice because we there were like five choices leading up to it. Uh -huh. So I think it's a free choice unless you're mind controlling me. Maybe. We'll just have to find out here in a second. So you said the jack of spades. Yeah. See, the interesting thing is, if I go here, Look, it's actually quite funny because before coming here, this is the first time we've ever met, right? Before coming here, I had one card. All the cards were face up. But there was just one that was face down. Now, how crazy would it be if it was the Jack of Spades? Oh my, Whoa. Oh my god. 
<laughs> That's crazy. That blew my mind. Awesome. So great. First time you got mind hacked, I, I presume? Yeah, I, I think you just like, did you do one of those uh, Christopher Nolan movie where Inception into my brain? Sort of. Okay. Sort of, All except right. you didn't feel it. <laughs> yeah, it was super quick. <laughs> So crazy. I was waiting for the weight to just, you know, switch out just a little bit. Something magical to happen. Something magical, but... Yeah, because you were holding on to it, so he wasn't messing with the deck while you were holding on to it. That's so crazy. It blows my mind. Exactly. Magic tricks. And if you guys want to watch more, I'm on Season 8 of Masters of Illusions, so you guys okay. can check out some more stuff there. You are the president of the Army Rangers Association, is that correct? That's correct. And why was it important for the Army Rangers to come out and support the Hollywood Christmas Parade? Well, we want to be here to support all of the families and the people who haven't had a chance to get together and uh, you know, be here to support this event. That gives everybody an opportunity to come back out and reconnect and rebuild relationships that have really had a, uh, a bad time over the last 18 months. That's great. And uh, what are you most looking forward to during this holiday season? Uh, I, I think that's exactly it, getting a chance to see family that I haven't seen in almost two years, getting a chance to see guys like this that I haven't seen in, a, in quite a while as well, uh, it, just the opportunity to reconnect. So I'm interested about all these guys you have with you. Could you tell me why they're here and how you're all connected? Sure. So right behind me, this is Tom Evans. He's the immediate past president. Uh, he actually lives here in the area. Uh, this is Joey Gatton. He is uh, involved with our Southwest region as well. Uh, this is our regional director for the Southwest region, uh, region Bill Wenger. Uh, we've got Jay Martin back here who came in all the way from Kentucky, if I remember right. Tennessee. I was close. Uh, Ronnie Immel, who also from California. And Louis Foskis Jr., Army Ranger. All uh, Rangers lead the way. Right. Yeah. How how does it feel being here tonight? I know we met at the press conference, uh -huh, yeah. and, and now you're going to be on the parade. Yes. Are you going to be doing shows, magic on the parade? Yes, just a little tiny. We put together a little routine uh, with Brandy over here, here, who's going to be helping me out. Oh, yes, wow. absolutely. She's the real star. Uh, I'm just, you know, I'm just there to, I don't know, facilitate. Uh. We are oh, doing yes. a special surprise. Okay. And it's uh, Christmassy, of course. Um, and I know he's doing something very special mm -hmm. along with it. We might get to hear him sing a little. Oh, oh. Yes, yes, there might be some singing. singing yes, I'm trying to think of something that's copyright free and we won't get in trouble. <laughs> a jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to, to ride, ride in a one horse open sleigh. Hey, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle, bells, jingle, bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one horse open sleigh. There we go. You know, it's wonderful being here, getting to, you know, you know, rub shoulders with the celebrities. Of course, the big, the biggest celebrity of them all, Santa's here. Uh, and I was able to surprise Santa because I told him, you know, he's not the only one with a twinkle in his eye. Look at that. Oh, mm, that's, it's nice. Yeah. Yeah. It's in the other one, too. So you can, you can move him around a little bit. Yeah. It's crazy. Just, do yeah. I have one? You do! Oh, oh, amazing! Yeah. Amazing! Okay. Now I want to see your act with you two together because I'm so intrigued. It's just a, it's just a quick little thing. Uh, it's all we we we, we kind of had time for, uh, but uh, we're excited to bring more magic in the future. So uh, be sure to watch Masters of Illusion. We've got the Christmas magic special out now. It's been playing a couple times uh, during December, and then uh, the new season I think starts sometime in January. And this is, I think the eighth season or something like that. It'll be my seventh consecutive season being on Masters of Illusion. That's all I know. But uh, yeah, lots of surprises from magicians around the world. So uh, check it, it out. It is the 89th Hollywood Christmas Parade. How does it feel being here today? You know what? This was kind of a tradition. I grew up in LA, mm -hmm. you know, so, you know, even coming down here, you come down here and just hang out. But but this is extra special. It's the first time I've ever been in I'm so proud, mm -hmm. you know, and because uh, this is for anybody from Los Angeles, this is this this is hey, it's Christmas, you know. And so from now on, I just brought down all the Christmas stuff from the garage, and like we're ready to start decorating the house. And you know. is the tree up yet or not yet? Oh, yeah, yeah, the tree's up. Yeah. What are some Trejo holiday traditions? Uh, tamales. We have to have beef. Wait, and uh. Uh, uh, chicken and uh, 
vegan. Do you make them? Yeah, well, oh. well uh, we make some, but now I got to give them a plug. Uh, Magali's tamales in San I Fernando. Taste some of the yeah. tamales. <laughs> and uh, and in the restaurant, you know, we're just yeah, we've got like you know, it's Christmas, and you'll see if you go there, it's it's Christmas for everybody. You've done a ton of movies, and you got a lot of businesses. How how long have, has Trejo's Tacos been in existence? This business now five years. We're going on six years. We just celebrated five and a half, well, five years of going. And uh, I started a record label. And one of my girls, Tara knew she did a that song Santa Baby. Yeah. You know, but but it was different. So we did it like Santa Baby, a '58 Chevy Impala will do <laughs> with bags and chrome. You know, so it's oh. a little different. <laughs> yeah, you got your More Hispanic. <laughs> got the Trejo spin on Santa Baby. I love it. We want tamales under the tree for me. <laughs> it's like friends of mine, what we do is we buy a bunch of toys. You know, we just go downtown, just buy a bunch of toys. And toys, tots, the Marines, uh, the mission, and, and, and then just pass them out on the streets. But we've always supported toys for tots. Those are the Marines. And it's just, it's so heartwarming. I dressed up as Santa Claus, right? And, oh my God. <laughs> and, then, okay. and then and then we pass out toys and it's so unbelievable to when kids uh, they don't want a toy they just want to hold santa and it's like oh god <laughs> I, I love it you know i love it well thank you so much it's so nice having you here and i hope you enjoy your night well one thing we're excited about is that we have just been involved in a beautiful movie it's uh, called yeah. the waltons homecoming. homecoming and it's a beautiful story about families coming together, yeah. getting along together, and Working everybody, problems and, yeah, you know, and it's just, just, just being a family, you know, and 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 it, and it, when it is, it, it's bringing everybody together, you and know. Every time we those talk things about don't the happen movie. today, Oops. you know. We need that. We 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 never never right now. Yeah, right. So I think that we're hoping that this film will will, will cause a little healing in, in our society. Thank you for doing that. As we tell people about this film. We're, we're amazed to hear so many people who say, oh, I just love Christmas movies. They're yeah, always right, so right, positive right, and, right, right. and they make you feel so good. And we said, this movie, this, this movie. will qualify. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Right. Is there any chance we could get a, a preview of a song from the movie or, or do we need to tune in to get that? Oh, well, uh, no, we, we can we give him a couple of lines. Yeah, right? okay, yeah. A couple lines would be amazing. Silent night and holy night. All is calm and all is bright round yon virgin. Mother, mother and child, holy infant, so tender and mild. Okay. <laughs> oh, that was beautiful. Oh, thank you so much. You brought in the Christmas cheer tonight. Right. You blessed us with those vocals. So you've supported this parade how many years? Oh, my goodness. Well, this parade's 89 years old. I mean, it's been for 89 years. I haven't been going quite that many. But I have been, I would say, close to 30. Wow. Because coming up next April is my 40th anniversary on the show. So I've been doing the parade for, for a number of years. So, I love it. So getting into the holidays. Holidays. What are some of your Christmas or holiday traditions that you're excited about? This parade. <laughs> well, the city of LA is lucky to have you. Oh, and what are you wearing today? This is this beautiful. This is from AG Fashion. Fashion. Yes, they, they're amazing. They're amazing. You have the dress, the purse, the earrings. You are I mean, bringing the Christmas cheer. And then this, I love this because it kind of moves. You're bringing the Christmas cheer down the carpet. You're kicking off the Christmas season for us. Oh, I like that. That's a good thing. Yeah.
That's a good well, thing. Well, it's always a pleasure to talk to you. Have a blast today. Thank you. So nice to see you. Great. How are you tonight? Great, thank you. Why is it important for you to come support the Hollywood Christmas Parade? I think after the couple of years that we've all been through, it's so important to be out here and to celebrate um, all the blessings, all the things we have to celebrate. There's so much that we've all gone through, and it's time for some kindness and for, I think for some joy. So I'm really happy to be here. That's great. And uh, what is a holiday tradition that you have coming up that you're excited about? Oh gosh, holiday tradition. You know, so I'm from Colorado originally, and our family, uh, we, instead of using gravy on our mashed potatoes, we put red chili on our mac, yeah, like spicy red chili. Uh, or sometimes we use New Mexico green chili, hatch chili, and that's one of my favorite things for Christmas. So not like the soup chili, but the actual, the chilies? Kind of like a soup stew chili, but it's, so it's like a gravy, um, and we put that over mashed potatoes and turkey or ham or eggs or everything. <laughs> that sounds delicious. Not on your pumpkin pie, but pretty much on everything okay. else. <laughs> so we're here at the 89th ho annual Hollywood Christmas Parade. How does it feel like being here supporting the Marines Toys for Tots? That rocks. It definitely does. So I know you have a, a project that just came out. Tell us a little bit more about it. During COVID, I was, we were able to bang out a film, the original Charvel Gang, which you can uh, see it on Apple and a few other platforms. It's about uh, this guitar manufacturing company in San Dimas made guitars for Eddie Van Halen, Slash, Rad, you know, Motley Crue, a bunch of bands. So it's pretty interesting. What was the genesis of this project? What gave you the idea to get it started? I, I was in between films and I knew most of these guys. I'm a guitar player. So I think if, if you are, if you speak their language, you have a much better chance of getting Slash to give you an interview. So it was, it was kind of a no-brainer, do what you know. So yeah. And uh, what's next? Uh, what project is next for you? Uh, the second Cherry Future. You're going to have to look that up. Beautiful parade. So amazing. The dancers were so amazing. I say so amazing so much, but literally, they are so amazing. We hope you enjoyed all the interviews on the red carpets. Uh, we know that we did. I know, and of all the people, I was so excited to talk to every single one of them. So excited to be here, too. And she got to meet Santa, so her heart's wish came true. Oh. <laughs> Hoorah to my Marines! Merry Christmas! <laughs> what a